The streamlined pad embraces the humble ferry boat. Here's the Cala Cala, last word in modern construction on our initial trip from Seattle to Bremerton. I'm Steve Rodriguez, and I'm the owner of the Calacla. Purchased it in September of 2003. Skipper Mangan commands the desired vessel, which can carry 2,000 passengers and has a speed of 18 knots. Welcome news to tardy commuters. What you're seeing is the interior of the passenger deck, which was designed for 2,000 passengers. The Calacla is 276 feet long from stern to bow. She was instantly famous and truly uh, was world renowned the day that she was introduced to the world. A streamlined ferry boat, first commercial vessel equipped with radar to guide it safely through night and fog on congested Puget Sound between Seattle and Bremerton. I left my hometown with a proposed mixed-use mixed mixed uh, design for an indoor-outdoor family recreational and entertainment facility. It had uh, almost the same square feet as the Calacla. The business plan was, was uh, for the demographics of a rural region and it penciled out with a projected 10 to 15 year maturity and it was, it was a successful design. Uh, the Calacla's 32,000 square feet of usable space was for the same purpose. What attracted me was it was about families, it was about, you know, preservation, and it was about history that could be saved perpetually for a good, good cause. We've got a future design of a double sweep Art Deco stairwell and balcony here. Uh, behind me would be a uh, a half moon piano bar on the promenade deck, uh, a level up, and the balconies would go around the side. Yes, I am the steward of this ship, and I am the captain steering her. But in my faith, I know that there are millions of people that will not allow me to give up. The ghost of the past of millions are on my shoulders. And I know that there's millions out there just waiting to see her come back.